I in this tutorial I'm going to give an explanation on the how there are two ways of addressing ECU one is uh, physical addressing and one is functional addressing so before going into the physical and functional addressing you have to aware of that access timing parameter uses this physical and functional addressing of service ID 83 uh, see it is right in, in this access timing parameter service it is recommended to use only physical addressing because the different sets of extended timing parameters supported by the servers so that is what it may be arise an interview question familiar very familiar question that how many types of address in the ECU can be done so for that you can answer the two ways and in this in which service it will support only physical addressing so this is one service which support only the physical addressing so this is just a flow you can go through uh, for using this access timing parameter you can use this flow that is first you have to use diagnostic session control then you can use access, access timing parameter then access timing parameter for set that is first is read and another is set timing parameters so the two ways of uh, address the ECU is see addressing ECU is uh, primarily you can use two ways one is physical addressing that is access accessing only one ECU and another one is functional addressing that is accessing multiple ECU so if you want to use uh, if whenever you are going to use uh, use or communicate with only one ECU you can go for physical addressing and whenever you are going for access multiple ECU so you can go for the uh, functional addressing so that's all about uh, physical and uh, functional addressing i have given very brief if you have any queries you can leave in a comment section bye bye catch you in the next video okay.